Training for the Kuriong rocket launchers starts, Navy to test fire frigates missiles in June 2022. Please like and share the video, and subscribe to the channel. The Philippine press reported recently that a contingent from the Philippine Army and the Philippine Marine Corps went to South Korea in the early part of this month of May 2022 to train for the maintenance and operation of the K-136 Kuriong multiple launch rocket system. The contingent is composed of 10 personnel and the training will include the live firing of the system. South Korea will reportedly also turn over a K-136 unit next month of June 2022. A total of 22 K-136 rocket systems are being donated by South Korea together with 22 M60 ammunition carrier trucks and 50,000 rounds of rocket ammunition for the system. This donation will give the Philippine Armed Forces from zero ground launched rocket systems to significant rocket system capability as those 50,000 rounds for 22 units mean that around 2,272 rockets can theoretically be allocated for each of those K-136 rocket launching system. Meanwhile, the flag officer in command of the Philippine Navy Vice Admiral Aide Luis Bordado announced during his speech at the 124th anniversary celebration to the Navy that they will be test firing the surface to air and anti ship missiles of the Jose Rizal class frigates next month of June 2022. This is what he said Maybe next, next month, we will witness the test firing. firing of our, our, our newly acquired, acquired weapon, weapon system, system. itong ating surface-to-air surface missile at saka surface-to-air missile surface-to-air missile and then and dyan 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 the Jose Rizal class frigates are armed with Mistral 3 surface-to-air missiles on Simbad RC launcher systems and Sea Star anti-ship missiles these will be the very first test firing of such missiles by the Navy Previously they had test-fired the Spike ER missiles a number of times, but those are multi-purpose weapons initially for use against tanks and structures but repurposed for use against vessels. Next month they will be firing purpose-built anti-air and anti-ship missiles. So to summarize, the training for the K-136 rocket systems have started, these units will provide the Philippines with significant ground-launched rocket system capability for the first time in its history. The Navy will also fire purpose-built surface-to-air and anti-ship missiles for the first time in its history. Thank you for watching the video, I invite you again to like and share it, and subscribe to the channel.